Hi, I'm Lance Tarchioni. And I'm Chris Callow. Technical agronomist for DeKalvin Asgrow in West Central Illinois. We're here today at a uh, large ExtendFlex market development trial. Uh, we've got about 70 plots like this across the state of Illinois where we're evaluating our new ExtendFlex germplasm that we'll be offering in the marketplace next year. The, um, you know, we're really proud of the fact that we've got uh, exclusive high yielding genetics within the Asgro brand. That's something that Asgro is known for and we're going to continue uh, to be known for with ExtendFlex. One way we're so confident we're, we're going to be able to offer that type of yield is that Extend and Extend Flex are the only two trait platforms that are based on the high yield Roundup Ready to Yield uh, germplasm technology. And a lot of soybean producers, you know, notice that when Roundup Ready to Yield came out and got established in the marketplace, we've seen a lift in overall soybean yield performance. And uh, and there's not a um, you know there's not a better reason for that than being built on Roundup Ready to Yield technology. Uh, we're also going to be able to offer the highest percentage of Extend Flex uh, within Asgro of any brand in the industry. And we've been breeding Extend Flex in the Asgro system for several years. One of the things that I really think is pretty cool when we talk about launching Extend Flex varieties this year is that this will be the second herbicide trait platform that we've launched in five years. So a couple years ago we launched Extend Soybeans and then we're getting ready to launch Extend Flex for 2021. Probably the only company in the industry that's been able to bring two different herbicide mode of action platforms that quickly to the marketplace. You know, when you look at this lineup, they're going to have the look and the feel of what you're used to with Asgro beans, right? So predominantly medium tall plants, medium to average bush plants. They're going to be predominantly gray beans with purple flowers. You'll find a few exceptions here and there that are a little taller that might have light tawny pubescence or white flowers, but for the most part, they're gonna have the look and the feel of Asgro beans just like we're used to. The agronomics are solid on most of these products, very good disease packages, good standability. We do still have a little bit of work to do to hone in on some of the disease ratings on some products, but for the most part, we're pretty confident in how these products are gonna perform in your fields. So we're going to be happy to have Extend Flex in the marketplace next year. It's going to offer uh, m more flexibility, which is you know what I love about the Extend Flex name. Uh, more flexibility and more options in your weed control program for next year. Uh, we still you know want everybody to uh, you know to be very confident in the performance of these varieties. Uh, you've come to know uh, Asgro for high yield high performance, consistency, uh, good disease scores, you know, a brand that you can count on and, and we're going to carry through with that with ExtendFlex.